What's up guys? Welcome back to Golf Simulator Videos. Have you ever asked yourself the question, how to improve my driver swing speed? All right, this is something a lot of people have actually been noticing is happening on like the PGA Tour, but even more amateurs are now getting into this. All right, they're trying to raise their driver club head speed and ball speed. That way they can hit drives further and have less club into the green. Well, there's actually a system that works with FlightScope Mevo Plus that has really caught my attention. So I first have to give a shout out to the local instructor uh, that I work with, Darren Hussey. He actually brought this to my attention. This is actually his system. It's the stack. All right, so make sure you check out HusseyGolf.com. He actually is the head of instruction at Warwick Hills Golf and Cl Country Club in the summertime. And then actually at Tyrone Hills Golf Club in the wintertime, they actually use an indoor golf simulator. So make sure you check that out. But the stack, what is it? Well, it's a swing training aid, right? But it's a lot more than that. It's actually a guided swing speed trainer using their app. And it actually pairs with FlightScope Mevo Plus. That way you can actually track that accurate swing speed number as you work on things. Now, let's just show the system really quick and how it works. I mean, this is basic stuff. This is just a threaded end there where you put weights on. It comes with five different weights, all right? And it's going to guide you on what weights, you know, to put on during each session. I'm gonna show you that here in just a second. And it does work with FlightScope uh, FS Golf. That's for PC and then also iOS, iPad, you know, uh, Android, all that stuff. But I really prefer to pair it with the app. So we just went through our baseline numbers a couple days ago and it's really nice. So you actually connect to your FlightScope Mevo Plus unit, you know, the Wi-Fi, and then open up the stack system. And I'll show you here in just a second. It shows you that your radar is connected and it guides you right through here using the speed from the FlightScope Mevo Plus with the stack system. Um, so if you're looking for a complete guided way on how to improve your driver club head speed, I really feel like this is just a simple system. And it's because you don't need a golf simulator. You don't even need a net or a mat or anything when you're just using this simple training aid. And I'm gonna show it in action here right now to show you what I'm talking about. So here I'm in the app, all right? You can see the foundation is kind of the meat and potatoes speed training program. I would probably recommend everybody starts there. And then they want you to you know, start a baseline where you're gonna actually swing your driver and then you're actually gonna swing various weights and then it's gonna set a baseline. And then uh, there's all kinds of other systems as well. Full speed spectrum, you know, heavy, neutral, all that. Even lead and trail arm enhancers, where I thought that was interesting during the baseline numbers, they want you to actually give a lead and trail arm uh, session to see if one's stronger than the other. So some people believe it or not, it could be a trail arm or a lead arm that's actually stronger in their swing. So let's go to special session. This is gonna be easy first look you know, video for you guys. You know, it's doing a quick review on the system to show you how it works. Let's go to speed priming. So let's say you're gonna go out pre-round, you wanna make sure you're warmed up and you got full speed on the first tee. You can go to start session. Now there is a lot of guided videos in here. You can actually say, don't show this video again. I didn't wanna do that because I wanted to show you guys how this worked, but it's really cool. They give you tips on warming up. They talk about safety, make sure you can swing freely, all that type of stuff. So watch this the first time around. You might be able to be good after that, but look at that, it's giving you warm up tips on how to warm the body up. That way you don't hurt muscles. So, uh, you know, it's, it's really good. So I'm gonna restart workout because I've actually been in this before. And then you can see right here, Flight Scope Mevo Plus is actually connected. All right, so we're good to go. I can hit continue. So it's going to give me another video on how this swing session should be performed. Intent. They're talking about full intent. All right, now I'm not really gonna do full intent here because I actually am supposed to be taking a couple days rest after doing that baseline number, but I have 195 grams on here. All right, and once that's all set, you can see my radar is green down in the lower right. Now, if, if you wanted to use another system that actually reads club head speed, um, you can do that and then enter it in manually. But watch how flawless this is using the FlightScope Mevo Plus. So I'm gonna swing a couple for you guys. Now here's what's cool. You don't need a golf simulator. I could be standing on my garage floor with no screen or anything. And that's what I find really interesting here. You might be a guy with FlightScope Mevo Plus that only uses it out the range, but you could be doing you know, driver swing speed improvement at home. I mean, heck, if you have enough room in your living room, if it's safe, you could do it. So there's my first swing, 90, not bad. I think I made it in the 90s. Um, during my baseline. I'm trying to remember what it was, if it was mid nineties, but it's amazing the weight, how much it slows down or speeds up your swing. 91, 
Now, for demonstration purposes, because I'm not going to go through all the different weights, notice how it has a resting time. That's really important, uh, in my opinion. I think you should wait on that. But let's just take all the weight off really quick. All right. This is where a lot of people might not realize how impactful weight is. All right. So now we're just the bare stack, no added weight. And let's see how, I'm not going to go crazy, but it's so different, so light. 114 <laughs> from 90 and I didn't even swing as hard as I could so it's just amazing what it does and you ramp up you go uh, heavy weight to low weight so what it does is you're swinging this very you know heavy club and I think it has you go down from 195 to 145 then up to the max 240 then to your driver so it's almost like, you know, hit intervals with your, your driver to speed up. But what's cool is, is this is just a warm up program. So they have that complete foundation program and a series on how you can improve your driver swing speed. So I really think this is something you guys should check out. It's called the stack. Once again, thanks to Darren for, uh, you know, letting us borrow this and actually letting me, you know, go through the program. So you guys are gonna have to stay tuned to the channel and see if we can actually increase our driver speed. Last year, I made my ball speed up to 169. Never broke 170 yet, I don't think. Um, so I, I'm really hoping to get in the 170s. The goal would be if I can get into the 170s, 175, let's say, maybe my on-course swing could be closer to 170, where right now it's probably, you know, maybe 165, maybe 160 even, I would, I would think, on, on out in the course. So it's probably 160. So love to hear what you guys think about this. Had to show this, you know, like I said, I, I didn't even really have this thing, you know, kind of, you know, aware in my uh, videos that were coming up. And then when he brought this to my attention, I was like, I really need to let people know about this because if you own a FlightScope Mevo Plus and you're looking to improve your, your driver club head speed, I really think you should look at the stack. It's really cool and it works great with the FlightScope Mevo Plus and it's so simple to use. So check it out, guys. I, as always, I appreciate you guys watching. Make sure you stay tuned. We're gonna be down at the 2024 PGA Merchandise Show here in a few weeks. Got a lot of great videos coming for you guys, so stay tuned for that.